president of a community group called RapLink. Can you tell me what RapLink is and what it does? Yes, RapLink is a voluntary organisation that um, aims to help communities to um, progress their own projects. We don't have projects of our own, but we link uh, communities to uh, resources and information that they need to help them with their own projects. What kinds of links does RapLink facilitate? We um, link communities to other communities. An example of that would be uh, we linked uh, to towns in New South Wales, uh, Forbes and Broken Hill. Forbes was losing medical facilities and Broken Hill uh, was of course losing mining, um, the mining industry up to a point. What other sorts of links? Uh, mostly um, between one community and uh, maybe some professional advice such as legal advice or financial advice. Um, we've certainly provided um, uh, legal advice through one of our members uh, to um, a town which was having some difficulties in expressing itself in the legal document. Um, we also have training facilities uh, in that uh, people who need to make um, submissions to government or any other organisations for funding um, can be helped to write effective submissions for funding um, and we have um, um, somebody who will help them online to do that. Um, we can also provide um, effective writing um, help um, either in person or again online. Um, an interesting link that we made was uh, when a farming group in fact, in South Australia, um, made uh, a request for somebody to come and manage the farm. Now, the farm was run by a, um, a person with a particular disability, and he needed to have a holiday, and his um, manager also needed to have a holiday, and uh, he had nobody to run the farm. And so an appeal was put out through our newsletter um, um, and we got a number of uh, responses to that and as a result everything was happy and they had their holidays and uh, the, somebody was able to go and look after the farm. Another thing that we do in the newsletter, which we really love to do, is to um, put, put out um, success stories in the community. So that if there's anything out there that the community has done which has been a success for them, we love to hear about it. An example of that would be um, the creation of what's called the firestorm tree in Canberra. And this tree was a tree that escaped the fires in 2003 and um, has now been carved into a history of the area. And um, the picture shows that the, the um, artist has sculpted the tree show it from the very beginnings of Canberra and the settlement by the local Ngunnawal tribe going up through the, the um, uh, settlement and industrialisation of the area right through to the fires in um, 2003. It's a lovely history and it was all put together by community effort. What do Rapt Link services cost? We make the link between the community and the resources or information that people need. That costs absolutely nothing, even if we have to do it more than once. Uh, generally speaking, uh, a link is the end of the story. But we do have one or two projects which are ongoing. This is not to say that there are no charges involved. Um, the people who provide the services, such as lawyers or accountants or landscape gardeners or whoever is required to help in that project um, is perfectly at liberty to charge whatever their professional fees are. We generally find that they charge either nothing or um, a reduced fee because it's a community effort. Elizabeth, can you tell me the process of what happens when somebody first makes contact with you asking for help from RapLink? Now we go to our member database to start with and see if there's somebody there who has the skills or services that the, that particular community is looking for and we put them in touch with, the, um, with each other. 
After that, it's up to them to, to work out what, what charges are going to be involved, if any at all, as I said. And can you tell me, what does being a member of RapLink involve? The name RapLink itself stands for Regional Action Partnership Link. Um, and so we feel that we're partnering with the community to get some action in the overall region. It's a way of people being in touch with each other. Uh, it's, it's a feeling of doing something worthwhile for one's own community and the wider community. We function all over Australia, although we're based in Canberra. And in fact, we have even um, uh, had some overseas links as well.